Hey, it's Tom from WPWithTom.com, and in this video, I'm going to be going over the best cheap web hosting. Now, before we dive in, I just wanted to go over a couple things. When it comes to web hosting, cheap doesn't always mean good. So I just want to get that clear off the bat, but I've tested dozens of hosting companies over the years, and in this video, I'll be going over the three best cheap web hosting providers out of the ones that I've tested. Now, in particular, I'm going to be going over the best cheap WordPress hosting plans here, and I want to make that clear. So additionally, I just kind of go over some of the features that I did with these tests. I tested these all anonymously, so I didn't have any preferential treatment with different hosting providers or anything like that, and I really just wanted to be upfront about that. Additionally, I'm going to have some affiliate links in the description below in this video. So these links should get you the best price available, and I'll even have an exclusive coupon code that you can get even more off of some of these hosts, or at least one of these hosts, in the description. So what I did here is test about a dozen hosting providers overall, and the criteria I set was that their plans had to be under $3 per month for a single website plan. So that was the first thing I did, and that eliminated a lot of different hosting providers right off the bat. And it made the testing a little bit easier because I didn't have to test so many of them. So let's dive into the results of these tests here. So since this is a video about the best cheap web hosting, the first thing that I wanted to cover, and probably the most important thing to you as a viewer, is cost. And the final three here that I narrowed this down to were DreamHost, Green Geeks, and Hostinger. And you can see that for a plan with DreamHost, you can get three years of hosting for a single site for $93.24. For Green Geeks, it would be three years for $89.64. And with Hostinger, you can actually get it for $42.72 for four years. So you're getting an additional year, and it's basically a little less than half the price of the competition. And I'll just throw it out there. This is only available if you use my link in the description and the special coupon code I have with it. WP with Tom. This WP with Tom coupon will work on any of the hosting or web hosting plans, so just be aware of that. But really, I just wanted to show you how cheap these plans can actually be. So if we look over here at speed, now this was for fully loaded times on the sites, and these actually got all good scores here, ranging from 1.3 seconds for Green Geeks to 1.6 seconds for DreamHost, with hosting in the middle at 1.5 seconds. Now, I tested these once a week over the course of a month, so I did four total tests with these, so the results can vary a bit. And actually, in fourth place, there was A2 hosting that had 1.7 seconds. It was just behind DreamHost in this test. And this really does play a big factor in determining my overall score when you combine the cost and the speed, because a lot of these cheap hosts that I tested were getting scores like three plus seconds, which was double or even almost close to triple sometimes these scores here. So in terms of support here, Green Geeks, I think, has the best support in the industry at this specific price range. I would definitely say they have above average support overall, but in this price range, they really stand out from the crowd, in my opinion, and they're a clear winner in first for me. Now, they do have 24-7 live chat support. They have ticket support. I've never had issues with their support before. Hostinger I put in second here, and Hostinger has solid support, but you only get that support once you're actually logged into your account within Hostinger. So if you're trying to have live chat support with someone else, at this time they don't offer that. I know they used to, and maybe because of what's going on in the global scenario right now, they're not offering it, and they might in the future again. I'm really not sure, but I know when you're logged into the account, you can have live chat support and get your answers quickly. Now for DreamHost, I don't think they actually offer live chat support all the time. In fact, I tried to reach out to them a couple times and they were all fine for a while and I wasn't able to get help unless I submitted a support ticket. I could utilize that method. So they did have support. It just wasn't as quick as the other two. And I've had some really good experiences with Green Geek support in the past here. So overall, I did put Hostinger in first and that's largely due to the costs associated with it. You're getting an extra year and it's literally less than half the price. If you wanted to upgrade to a plan that has a little bit more features, which I'm going to go into in a second here, you would pay a little bit more than this, but at the same time, you're going to get the most bang for your buck with Hostinger. If you just want to get a website up online quick and cheap, then I definitely suggest using the link below and my coupon to get this really exclusive discount here and bring the cost down 
and then you can just put a website up very quickly. In the future, if you wanted to change host, you can do that, but if you want to get online for less, this is the way to go with Hostinger. I do think that overall Green Geeks actually probably has the best power and support in terms of the speed and the support from what I've tested, and the cost isn't bad with them, so I do think they could easily be swapped for first over Hostinger, but since you're looking for cheap hosting, Hostinger is going to take the cake in this one. And then DreamHost is just behind in third place for me. I do think DreamHost has some pretty good plans, solid speed. I think the support could be a little bit better, but you know, you're nitpicking when you're talking about these prices. These are very affordable prices because there are web hosts out there that charge $20 or $30 a month just to host one website. Granted, their support might be a little bit better than what these are, but the amount of money you're spending over the course of the year is hundreds of dollars more. And next, I just wanted to jump into some of the features related to these plans that I'm talking about here. So let's dive into that. Now, over here on Hostinger, we can scroll down on this page, and you can see it starts at $0.99 cents a month right now. And some of the key things I wanted to cover here are you get free SSL, and you get one email account as well for free in the plan. Now, they do have a free domain offer, but that's actually only available when you go into the bigger plan. So right here, you can see it's an X on free domain, and then this one does include it. So just be aware of that if you're trying to get a free domain name included in the plan. Basically, it's going to be offset. You're getting a, you're paying a dollar more per month, but the value of it is right around $9. So it's almost a wash when you're looking for the free domain when you're comparing these plans. Additionally, if you want to have more bandwidth or unlimited bandwidth like this right here, you would need to go up to the $1.99 a month plan. Now, just keep in mind, this $1.99 a month plan is still cheaper than the other two plans that I'm going to go into with Green Geeks and DreamHost. So if you wanted to do this one and then use my coupon code, then you can get an even lower rate than the other two still offer. So this plan would also be cheaper in terms of the actual cost overall. Now the other ones I'm going to cover here actually have daily backups, but this one actually comes with weekly backups with their plans. So you can actually go right here and you can see more or less features, but it says weekly backups right here for these two plans. And this one has daily backups for this $3.99 plan. So those are some things that you want to be aware of when you're deciding if this is the host for you. At least you'll get some backups. For this cheap, it's really hard to argue or complain about any of it, in my opinion. It's just the easiest way to get online for less money. And if you really want to get a little bit more, then you can go with this plan and still get online for very cheap overall. So next, let's go and look at Green Geeks over here. Now right here, you can see that they have this light plan. It's $2.49 a month. So this $1.99 a month plan that I was just discussing is actually cheaper than the cheapest one over here on Green Geeks. And this is for one website. Now this does come with a little bit more than what we saw with Hostinger because it comes with a free domain name for one year. So the first year is a free domain name and it has free nightly backups, free CDN, unlimited email accounts rather than one. So you're getting more with the actual plan here with Green Geeks, but you are also paying more and you have to have a three year duration plan at a higher rate than a four year plan at a lower rate on Hostinger. But this is a really solid package that you can get for this cheap. It's hard to be at this price point, I feel like. So the last one over here is DreamHost, which was my one that came in third place. And you can see it has $2.59 a month at the starting price. It comes with a free domain name included, free SSL certificate. So this, those are nice to have. And it does also have the free daily backups, as I mentioned earlier, and a few other things as well. Overall, I think that the Green Geeks plan right here comes with the most power in all of these plans, probably followed by DreamHost and then this one. But if you were to upgrade over here, this is very comparable to the other two. So just be aware of that when you're looking and trying to select these plans. And that really wraps up what I wanted to talk about here in terms of the best cheap WordPress hosting or the best cheap web hosting. And you can see that each of these plans I'm going to have links to below to make sure you're getting the lowest price that you can. So that about wraps up this cheap web hosting video here. And I hope you enjoyed this video overall. If you did, please give it a like and subscribe for more WordPress related content. Thanks for viewing and have a wonderful day.